incredible, man. Grew up watching these boys, man. Can't be I'm here, dog. It's unreal. There's my family right here. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's kind of like a dream come true. As a kid, he's coming to the stadium thousands of times to watch the Cowboys and Redskins, where he's booed the Cowboys. And to be back here playing in front of family and friends, it hadn't hit me yet, but it's kind of surreal. It's kind of surreal. Awesome feeling. Awesome feeling. Hello, where you? Hello, right across the street. One minute away. Football usually starts as a family function, playing in the yard with your brother, going to games with your mom and dad. And for the Nittany Lions, playing in an NFL stadium brought back a lot of memories about the role football played in growing up, and it still does at Penn State. Perfect place to develop as a player and even more. The trip to FedEx Field was a chance for seniors to have one more moment in the sun. From the eye, Royster behind Stewie. McGloin turns, gives the ball to Royster, up the middle, touchdown, Penn State! And as time grows short for seniors, underclassmen pick up the pace. Learning from the rest and the best. Some with a chance to eventually play in a place like this on Sundays. McGloin, red hot start, pump fakes, now he wants a deep man. Looking for Damon Smith, first down Penn State! A 34-yard strike from McGloin. Play action, McGloin rolls right, throws back, and he's got it. Touchdown, Penn State. The Nittany Lions cap a 99-yard drive, their longest of the season. McGloin to the end zone. All the ball. Touchdown, Derek Moore. Against Indiana, Penn State started strong and finished strong. In the middle, the Hoosiers made the Lions work for their success. Chapel looks that way. A slant. Touchdown, Indiana. With 6 11 to go in the third, it's a shootout. It was the perfect time to show how those who work hard are given opportunities. An opportunity to become a hero. There was little doubt after the special teams touchdown which way this game would go. Over the middle, intercepted. Astorino picks it off on the 43 yard line. Dealing with injuries and inexperience much of the season set Penn State up to eventually succeed against Indiana, as it will eventually with life. The game a microcosm of the Penn State experience. Individuals pushing together for group success. It started and ended with family game as well as the love of football and somewhere along the way the finished product is not another win but maturity manhood